ChatGPT is uh, uh, an AI system that basically guesses the next word. It's a fancier version of uh, auto autocomplete that we are all used to on our iPhones and our email uh, clients and so forth. Advertisers are using it to write copy, that is, uh, ad messages, so it can create new, uh, you know, new kind of uh, uh, poems, if you will, or jingles that advertisers can use. Uh, public relations people are using it to write press releases and then tinker with it. So I think it's a it's a great uh, first draft um, uh, assistant. I see on the negative side um, the threat to cybersecurity from large language models just growing more and more. Uh, so in addition to things like phishing attempts I mentioned earlier, uh, there's been some research in creating malware using ChatGPT uh, to write the code for the malware or to find exploits. It makes it easy for a potential bad actor to generate lots of articles on some view that they want to advance in online discourse. Uh, so it used to be you had to hire a person to actually write articles um, stating this information or opinion pieces uh, stating your point of view. Uh, now it's possible to just generate lots of these with very little time and then presumably post them several different places so that if someone wants to search for public opinion, they'll see all these articles that seem to be written by people, but in fact, they aren't. So machines don't have soul. They don't have uh, creativity or originality in the same way that a uh, human does. And therefore, whatever is generated by ChatGPT is really a cobbling together of words which may sound right, but it may not, in fact, be factually correct. We don't want to destroy these technologies or outlaw them. That, I think, makes no sense. So we can't put this genie back in the bottle. But it is appropriate to, uh, to create them ethically.